I'll let him. Let me your hands. Make that team walk. And welcome to Werewolf Wednesday. Welcome to Werewolf Wednesdays, everybody. I believe it's time for another top five list. And today, we are counting down the top five best werewolves in video games. So here we are, the top five best werewolves in video games. Number five, Link from Twilight Princess. When this game came about, it's like, oh my god, this is going to be a new awesome epic adventure. And then you get this trailer, and you see Link fucking transform into a wolf and you know automatically for me that translate okay he's a werewolf now but it was cool and it was only integrated into the game at certain points when you needed it to and it could be fun it was a cool gimmick but the overall idea of our favorite hero from the legend of zelda series becoming a werewolf he's awesome as it is and this just adds just a little more awesomeness to him number four Sonic the Werehog. Oh god, why would I pick this for the number 4 spot over Link as a werewolf? I mean, a lot of people hate Sonic as a werehog, but the idea is a lot more developed, and in the Xbox 360 and Wii versions, you get different ways you can play as the werehog. The action is a lot of fun, the levels drug out a lot. But either way, even if you put Knuckles in place of the Werehog, the levels would have felt the same. They were just picking an excuse to make it seem like that the Werehog was the problem. If you had Knuckles in there, it would still be the same issue. The levels would have drunk out a little more. The problem would have got a little less hate because they could play as Knuckles, but all the same, it wasn't the Werehog that was the problem. Hell, even, they even got an animated short called Sonic Night of the Werehog to promote the game. It was a cool little short with no dialogue, with some cool fight sequences and some very good comedic timing. One of my favorites to look back on every so often. Even, even the transformation at the beginning of the game is pretty badass. I mean, the design is underwhelming for a lot of people, but I thought it was pretty good. If you're gonna take a blue hedgehog and transform him into a werewolf, so props for that. Number three, Alternate Beast. When I was a kid and I was playing this game, where I knew I could become these were creatures, I was like, this is gonna be cool. I gotta go save my girlfriend and whatnot and blah blah blah. But as I was playing, I would defeat these creatures, I would get the power, I'll get a little bigger. It's like, ooh, these are like steroids. Do a little more, get a little bigger. It's like this is awesome. And I get one more, and I get this brief animation. Well, I am transforming into a badass werewolf that can shoot fucking fireballs and do a light dash across the screen into my enemies. What the hell did I just smoke? This is the most awesome thing I have ever seen. This is the best thing I've ever done in a video game. Just a completely badass moment of my childhood and something that resonates as completely awesome. Number two, the Skyrim werewolves. Whenever I play Skyrim, I'm always a werewolf. What, vampire? Whatever and just any other options out the window. Being a werewolf in Skyrim is just one of the most badass campaigns ever. And when you're a werewolf, you're just this legendary beast and you're just like, get out of my way. I'm gonna do what I want, when I want, and I'll come and go as I please. This is the best choice. Not biased or anything, it is just a completely awesome way to experience the legendary Skyrim. And the number one video game werewolf is Ralph from Rampage. Hear me out. I'm gonna say this once, and it's the reason he is the best werewolf. Fucking look at him. He is almost as tall as a building. Any werewolf has existed in any video game, or any movie, or TV series. They're not exactly as tall as a building. They might be tall to the ceiling, but they're not freaking four stories tall, or however tall he is. He is a fucking monster, and he is the best video game werewolf just because of that. He will squish any other werewolf into a bloody paste if he wanted to. Just no contest, he wins every time. 
Plus, he's blue. He's awesome. He burps. He's just a badass all around. And he's the only character I ever played whenever I played these Rampage games. Ralph is the number one video game werewolf of all time. This has been a Werewolf Wednesday. And we'll see you next time on Team Epic Force.